let's fix the lag in iOS 16. Now, if you've upgraded to iOS 16, it's technically meant for phones that are newer, but it will be available to a lot of older phones. The truth is, is that every time Apple upgrades their iOS operating system, it's meant for running on the latest version, which means it can be a processor and data hog, and it can really slow down and lag your phone if you have an older phone. But there are a few different things that we can do to definitely get those sped up. Now, one of the things we'll head into settings here, and then we're gonna adjust some settings. So let's go down and tap on general, and then background app refresh. This is a really big thing. This allows any app to continue to operate even though you're not having it on the screen on your phone. I always turn this off. I don't really need it. If I want a phone, an app to be running, I'll open it up if I want to check it. So I would recommend turning that off. That will help with any sort of lag. The next thing that we'll do is go into iPhone storage here. What you want to check here is that you have more than say one or two gigabytes available on your phone itself. If you're running at the very maximum amount of storage, then you might want to free up a little bit of storage because this can help fix you know, any kind of slow, snow, slowness or um, any glitches in your phone that causes it to lag. So do those two things. The next thing that I would recommend doing is let's go back and then go to accessibility here and then go to motion and then you're going to turn on reduce motion. And what this does is it removes those animations that make everything smaller. Say when you swipe up, you can see instead of it reducing down to a very small amount and then disappearing, it just removes that screen and switches to a different screen. So I recommend reducing this motion here. This makes everything better in older phones that experience any kind of lags. Now, another thing that I'll recommend doing is swiping over all the way to the right here. And you can see here are all of your widgets. These are things that are running all of the time. And if you have 50 different widgets on here, then it could be slowing down your phone as well. So just tap the edit button and I would just you know continue to get rid of these. I don't really personally like this page all that much. So I'm fine with it being completely blank. If I want that information, I can always go to the lock screen now in iOS 16 or just go to the app itself. So now that you've done those different things, I recommend just generally closing out of apps. So swiping up and closing out of apps. And then every once in a while, just restarting your phone. That clears a bunch of cache. It resets the memory on your phone and a lot of times will fix any sort of lag. So try to reset or not reset, try to restart your phone once every few days and that should help any kind of lag. Hope this helps. Thanks for your time today and I'll see you on the next one.